In this video, we're going to be taking a look at how to schedule a patient. Scheduling a patient is can be done from two different locations. As you, write, as you see right now, I'm in, in the patient's chart. And in the patient's chart, you have the add appointment. So from the patient's chart, you can click on add appointment and create appointment here. You can also go to the calendar to add a patient's appointment. If you click on the month in the middle here, you'll notice that on the right, it gives me all the way out to August of 2022. So I can quickly jump from one month to the next or go where I need to in order to create the appointment that I'm looking to create. So I don't have to use, if I use this arrow button here, then it's gonna take me month by month and I have to wait for each screen to load. So a faster way to do this would be to go ahead and use the, if I need to schedule a patient on January of 2022, and I'm going to make it for the 5th of January, then I can jump to that location. Now, if I'm on the calendar, when I select the time frame for the appointment, if you notice, it will populate with the open patients chart in the window. This is something you have to be careful of when you're in a chart and you're trying to schedule a different patient. Always look at the patient to make sure it matches the patient that you want to put in or on the calendar. Because if you're in a particular chart, when you open the calendar appointment from the calendar, it will have the patient's chart that you have open. So if I needed to change this to another patient, I would need to type in that patient's name and do a search for that patient. Oh, I put the wrong thing in. I should have put in a feel. There. And now it will change it to the patient that I really want to schedule. And then here I'm going to click the appointment category. Now the durations are tied to the appointment calendar categories and we'll be going over those in a different video and so you can change your durations based on the calendar appointment type <laughs> uh, excuse me I'm gonna leave that in there authenticity all right so that takes care of scheduling an appointment on the calendar oh hold on there is a couple more things here as you can see, my, my provider calendar is not set up properly. Without my calendar prop set up for the provider, it will prompt you to say, hey, there's no appointments for this provider. If you tell it OK, it's not going to stop you from scheduling the appointment. All it's really going to do is just tell you that this calendar is not set up properly, so it cannot find open time slots. Tell it OK, and it will schedule the appointment and close this window here because it could not find available appointments. And that's all for scheduling. Thanks for watching.